So let's say you've come up with a sign like this for a place and the cap letter, or the height of one of these letters is, you know, exp expressed in one of, you know, this late height of this line and right now. Actually at actual size it's about a little over a foot tall. But let's say the guy doesn't want to pay that much and you want to scale everything down so that the height of a letter is about six inches. How that works, select the line that is the height of one of these letters shift select the combination of shapes and then run the uh, uh, Shelby auto size macro this is where you tell it what you want that cap height to be so if we typed in six inches it apply scales it all down all right so when I take my six inch line over here six inches tall right put it into position there and you can see that it's um, scaled at about the height of a cap letter there all right so obviously that's going to be too small. So what if we knew that uh, we wanted to just see how this might look at, I don't know, 8 inches tall. So what we do here is take the 6 inches, uh, select this one, go back here and type in 8. And it scales it up so that the cap height, if I was to make a little box here, give it a different color for a second, type in 8. It's basically scaled up the group of shapes, right? There you go.